This is how you become overpowered in Tears of the Kingdom. A lot of people are wondering what the best gear in Tears of the Kingdom is. Well, look no further. Here it is. The Fierce Deity Armor. Why is it the best? If you're wearing the entire set of clothing, you get plus nine to all of your attacks. It's kind of like the Barbarian Armor in Breath of the Wild. First, you're going to want to go to the Foothill Stable. See this dog? You're going to want to feed him about five or six items. So the dog is going to lead you into this cave. He's going to show you a treasure chest. You're going to open it and you're going to get a message in a bottle. Next, you want to go to Skull Lake, the north side of the map. And if I were you, I'd recommend saving here just in case when you dive in, you hit the edge. Land right in the water. Break through these rocks. Ignore, ignore, ignore. And right up here will be a chest with your first set of armor. Next, you want to go to the Akala Citadel Ruins. Once you get to the ruins, you're going to go right here and duck through this wall. Just like that, you'll find your second piece of armor. Finally, you're going to want to go to the ancient tree stump. Jump down here, cut through these vines, and up we go. Once you get to the top, you'll find your last set of armor. Once you have all the armor, you want to return to the first cave you went to. Once inside, this giant stone gate will open, and you'll be greeted with a brand new weapon.